Hey everyone, this is Kush of the Game Time Blog and the Video Game Review Podcast. I wanted to give my thoughts on the 15 Legends for NBA 2K12's NBA's Greatest Mode. I know I'm a little late to the party at this point since it came out a couple weeks ago, but I did want to give my thoughts on a couple things I would have liked to have seen with the challenges. Now, we know the 15 guys, everybody knows it's Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, Larry Bird, Dr. J, Wilt, Patrick Ewing, Magic Johnson, MJ, Carl Malone, Scottie Pippen, Oscar Robertson, Hakeem Olajuwon, Bill Russell, Jerry West, Isaiah Thomas, and John Stockton. One of the thing, one of the problems I have, and I have a couple issues with this, besides the whole Charles Barkley, Reggie Miller, because we know 2K came out and said the reason they didn't get Charles, it was a contract issue or a money issue, they couldn't get a deal worked out, probably something similar with uh, Reggie Miller. So I understand that. So I'm not even talking about those two guys, although it would be nice to eventually see them on the game at some point in the future. But looking at the list, overall, I'm happy with the challenges. One, one of the challenges I have an issue with, and you know, it, for me personally, I wouldn't have had it, and if they insisted on having this guy in there, this guy, I mean, I love this guy because I'm a Bulls fan. I'm talking about Scottie Pippen, right? The Scottie Pippen challenge. I'm a diehard Bulls fan. I love Scottie Pippen. Big Pippen fan. Always have been. Uh, one of the greatest defensive players of all time. But the thing is, I don't think we needed a Scottie Pippen challenge for the 96 Bulls versus the 96 Sonics. Not really a challenge. It's more like a game because they're not requiring you to score specific points with the players. It's just you play the game. So it's not really a challenge. It's just the game. So the Scottie Pippen game, 96 Bulls versus 96 Sonics. We had that on NBA 2K11. Three Bulls teams total will be on NBA 2K12. You have the 88-89 Bulls, which are part of the Isaiah Thomas game. And then you have the 92-93 Bulls, which is part of Michael Jordan's game. So I don't think we needed to have the 96 Bulls on there again with Scottie Pippen. But, and again, I have no problems having a Pippen game. I'm a Bulls fan, so, you know, I like it. If 2K insisted on having a Scottie Pippen game for NBA 2K12, what I would have recommended, if I if I were in charge, what I would have recommended for Scottie Pippen to use the 1994 Chicago Bulls, the 93-94 Bulls, the year Michael Jordan was retired. That was a true challenge for Scottie Pippen because he had to step in the Jordan's role as the leader of the Bulls. So that would have been a little bit different, you know, scenario. You wouldn't have had Michael Jordan, so you would have been playing. Scottie Pippen would have been the best player on that team. You would have had Pippen, you would have had Horace Grant, a rookie Tony Kukoc, B.J. Armstrong, and then the only extra, the only different guy you'd have to get on there is Pete Myers, who was the starting two guard the year Jordan was retired, and maybe a couple other bench players like Corey Blunt or something like that. But the 93-94 Bulls would have been a good choice, and then the opponent could have been, instead of the 96 Sonics, you could have used the 1994 Sonics, the 93-94 Sonics, who had the best record in the NBA that year and then became the first number one seed to lose in the NBA playoffs to an eight seed to the Denver Nuggets, and those 93-94 Nuggets are featured in the Hakeem Olajuwon game with the uh, world champion 94 Rockets taking on that those Nuggets. So I would have liked to have seen that. I, I you know, it, Scottie Pippen would have been my first choice to put in the 15 Legends, not because I don't think Scottie Pippen's one of the greatest of all time. Of course, I, I think he is. But, you know, we got to play with Scotty a lot last year as part of the Jordan challenges. And, you know, there's a couple other Bulls teams on here this year. Maybe it was just, you know, easy. They had Pippen signed. You know, they could have, you know, it was easy to do the challenge. But if you were going to do Pippen, I would have liked to have seen the 94 Bulls and another 1994 team, either the Seattle Supersonics, if you wanted to keep it with Seattle, or the 94 Knicks, who knocked off the Bulls in seven games in the Eastern Conference semifinals that year. So I would have liked to have seen that. Um, another thing, what I would have done personally, instead of doing the, see, I, I didn't like the idea of having the Carl Malone, John Stockton, Michael Jordan, Scottie Pippen games, because you can play with Scottie Pippen on the Jordan challenge. You can play with John Stockton on the Malone or the Malone on the Stockton either, or I would like to have seen some other guys incorporated. For example, um, we know David Robinson and Tim Duncan are going to be on the game and one of the classic Spurs teams. 97-98 Spurs is you know part of the Carl Malone challenge versus the 97-98 Utah Jazz. So you have you have Tim Duncan, you have David Robinson, you probably could get the other guys like Avery Johnson, Sean Elliott and all those guys. I don't know why they chose not to have a David Robinson game and use the 99 San Antonio Spurs who won the championship in the lockout short in 99 season. I thought that would that would have been a cool team to play with, the 99 Spurs. And then you could have used the 1999 New York Knicks, who they beat in the finals. And the 99 Knicks were a really cool team that year. I mean, when they, they were an eighth seed, they were the second number eight seed to win ever 
And then, of course, the Golden State Warriors beating the Mavs ended up being the third, and the, the Warriors were the first ever eight seed to win a seven-game series. This is back when they were five-game series in 94 for the Nuggets and 99 for the uh, for the New York Knicks. But that, ni- that 99 Knicks team was a cool team. I mean, they went on a nice run in the playoffs, knocking off the heat with Allen Houston's shot, and then just destroying the Atlanta Hawks in the second round. I think I think that was a four-game sweep, and then uh, knocking off Indiana in the conference finals. So I would have liked to have seen David Robinson in the 99 Spurs versus the 99 Knicks. It would have been cool to play with that Knicks team, even though I'm a Bulls fan I hate the Knicks. But that year, watching Camby and Sprewell and and Allen Houston make their run through the Eastern Conference playoffs is pretty impressive that year. So I, I would have liked to have seen something different, just because again, I as a Bulls fan, you know, I played with a lot, you know, Scottie Pippen's not new to me. I played all the Jordan challenges last year, played a ton of games with Scottie Pippen last year. I'm gonna get my Scottie Pippen fix this year with the other Bulls teams. I don't know if I would have used Pippen and or or Stockton and Malone to have them separate ones. I would have came up with you know somebody else throughout history that they could have got. I mean, there's probably, you know, if they couldn't get Barkley and Miller, that's fine. They probably could have got somebody else. But, you know, I'm not complaining too much. I mean, overall, I like what they did. I'm looking forward to playing with, uh, again, some of the non-title teams I'm looking forward to play with, like uh, the 93 Hornets. That's going to be a lot of fun, playing with uh, Larry Johnson, Alon- a rookie Alonzo Mourning, Kendall Gill, Muggsy Bogues. That, that'll be fun. The uh, 72 Knicks, you know, they didn't win the title that year. But, you know, as a Bulls fan, get to play with Phil Jackson as a player. That should be interesting. You know, Walt Frazier. So, got some uh, nice players there. Um, you know, the 85 Milwaukee Bucks. That should be pretty interesting. 86 Atlanta Hawks. You still get Dominique, even though you had Dominique on last year's game. The 94 Nuggets will be pretty interesting with uh, Mahmoud abdul Rauf and uh, uh, Dikembe Mutombo. So, and Pistol Pete on the 71 Hawks. So, they, they, they got some good games. A younger Kobe Bryant with the uh, 98 Lakers. 97, 97, 98 Jazz versus the 98 Lakers. And then, of course, the two DLC teams are, you know, pretty cool. We got Run TMC with Golden State, 90, 91 Warriors, and the 2001, 2002 Sacramento Kings, which was a very, very good team. Um, so, overall, I think 2K did a good job. I just would have did something a little differently. I, I probably wouldn't have had Pippen. Because, again, you can play you can play with Pippen on the Jordan game, and then I wouldn't have separate Carl Malone, John Stockton's, because you can play with both of those guys on one of them. I would have incorporated some different players. Definitely would have did a David Robinson one. I don't know why, if you have David Robinson locked up, why you didn't give him his own game. But, and I would have used the 99 Spurs or maybe even the, I think he was, yeah, his last year, wasn't he? I believe he retired after the 2003 championship. You could have used the 2003 Spurs and had Robinson, Duncan, and Ginobili and, and Tony Parker and those guys. But overall, I think 2K did a great job with the list, and I'm looking forward to playing with some of these uh, different old-school teams.